Debbie Mensch happens to be one of the great violin teachers, not only in the country, but in the world. She's one of the most humble, kind, and loving people you will ever come across. She just happens to be one of the great violin teachers. Her knowledge of violin and pedagogy is truly unparalleled, and I've seen thousands of violin teachers. She's just objectively fantastic at what she does. I have a lot of Mrs. Minch's teaching ingrained in me still today. I remember how perfectly calm and composed she always was in lessons, no matter how crazy I was. She was always positive. There wasn't any negativity about any of her comments. If there was something that we did that she didn't like, she would um, come up with a non-negative way of telling us how to fix it. And that's certainly one of the things that I have tried to carry on as a teacher myself. When I watched my older sister having a violin lesson when I was in third grade, I thought, this is what I want to do. My goal was to play the violin because I thought it was so beautiful, but to end up teaching. So it happened early. I would notify all those new kids that were coming the next fall for lessons at school that I was a private teacher, and I would teach them for 25 cents. The method teaches discipline, and uh, there's the positive reinforcement, so they feel good about the violin and music. And they learn the dedication and what it takes to build a skill. And that helps them in every part of their life. So the success gets very complicated because I think it, it happens everywhere. The beautiful music they make is making a beautiful heart that helps them throughout all their uh, dealings in life. And I see wonderful human beings all around me, my former students, and I, it's the best thing about teaching, how the children grow up and they carry the principles of, of honesty and integrity into their lives. One of the great things about the Suzuki Method is the ongoing teacher training. I'm a product of teacher trainer course after teacher trainer course and having the education available to me to improve my skills has, has totally changed my life and every other teacher who goes to teach and takes teacher training. Traveling with Debbie's Rocky Mountain Strings was something that really opened the world to me as a person and ever since then I've traveled a lot with music and different music projects and connected with musicians all over the world and I'm so grateful to Debbie for changing so many young people's lives. She always is able to focus on the positive and work with what we bring to the table. She loves teaching children when they're young and she can envision them the way they're going to be older and she sees their qualities. She's also able to link the way that child plays to the personality of that child and she um, really just does an incredible job with all of the work that, that she does. When I begin new music students I speak about the incredible impact that music has had on my life and list my music teachers as those who have had the greatest influence on my character outside of my family and Debbie definitely falls squarely into that category. The purpose of the, the Mensch uh, teacher training program at the Gifted Music School is to make sure that her teaching philosophy, her methodology, and her spirit continues to thrive and grow in future generations. We want to be able to preserve her legacy and to continue it 
and make it vibrant for future generations.